We're getting an update on the people injured in a deadly roof collapse. And you can see the giant hole on top of Friendswood High School. One person was killed. ABC 13's Brianna Connor has been on top of this all day. Brianna, what else do we know about this collapse? Erica and Eric, I would say within the past 30 minutes, we saw several crews leaving out of here for the night. That boy's gym is just behind me, and we're told it was under construction when this collapse happened. There was a team of investigators here from OSHA looking into what happened, but also in this parking lot where I'm standing, there are several local first responders on standby just in case something went wrong with that team inside the structure that may still not be secure. We want to show you more of that sky eye video from earlier this evening. It really gives us the best view of the damage. The district says this is a construction site and it's summertime on top of that, so no student or staff were here when the pieces of the roof crashed down around 4.30 this afternoon. One construction worker was killed. Three other men working on the gym were taken by ambulance to UTMB Clear Lake with injuries described as non-life-threatening. Everyone else has been accounted for. We know that residents approved a bond back in 2020 to pay for projects in the school district like this new gym, but we don't know how close they may have been to completion. Everyone at the scene directed our questions to FISD, but the district hasn't made anyone available to provide answers. A search of their records, however, does show a company called ICI Construction got the bid to build this new gym. We did reach out to them as well to try to get some more information. We have not heard back, but again, one person killed, three men hurt while working on this new boys gym behind me. We are told OSHA is going to look into this to try to figure out what went wrong. Live in Friendswood, I'm Brianna Connor, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.